Bruised and bloodied is not how Kabonina Mkonza thought she would go into retirement. But she found herself fighting for her life after her employer's son alle allegedly attacked her for, quote, being black. Newsroom Africa Sipa Kema has more on this disturbing story. After 22 years as a domestic worker for a family in Ekuruleni, 64-year-old Kabonina Mkonza never thought the children she raised as her own would threaten her very life. And then the parliament, we are boy, as a gentleman. About a bow, Ramaposa, a Baza in Mali, a government, Nama family, Zuabo, Abo Malema, Baza in Mali, a bank, a Ute, a Petersburg, a Pupa Prokisi Bank, Abo Zuma, Nabantona Babo, Baza in Mali, but Total Abo Bahamba Bausala Namakut. According to Mkonza, because of the alleged corruption within government and amongst politicians, she found herself fighting for her life. The FF in Gauteng is calling for justice. We are trying to put the laws in the legislature and in the parliament to say our justice system, it needs to be inclusive. Because what happened here is not a light matter. This person who beat and hit and kicked the old woman, whatever he was saying to her was, your black people who are busy leading South Africa are very corrupt. So the EFF will be in court in Springs at half past eight. So we're going to support the family. The suspect was apprehended by the police after Mkonza managed to escape. He will appear at the Springs Magistrates Court on Thursday morning. For News from Africa, Channel 405, I'm Sipa Kema in Tsakane.